Hey, what's up everyone? This is Music Tech Help Guy. And in this video, I wanna show you a super secret plugin in Logic Pro that you've probably never used before that you can use to clean up your voice recordings. This is the AU Sound Isolation plugin. So if you're doing a shot like this where you're just using your phone to do a vlog post for Instagram or TikTok or whatever it may be, and you're not using a separate microphone like a clip-on lapel mic or maybe a separate mic uh, in camera or off camera, if you're not using a separate microphone, you're sort of just limiting your audio quality to what your phone can record. And right now I'm in a big untreated room the AC is running on full blast and you can probably hear quite a bit of reverb in the room. So let's run back this video with the AU sound isolation plugin on my voice. And one quick side note, the AU sound isolation plugin is not just a normal logic plugin. It's actually an Apple AU component plugin. So you're going to go down to audio units in your audio effects then go up to Apple, and then down at the bottom of the list, you'll see AU Sound Isolation. The controls are very minimal. Everything is just done with one slider. If you pull this all the way over to the right at 100%, you're gonna get the maximum amount of sound isolation. So this is going to reduce the background noise and reverb as much as possible. And then if you pull this all the way over to the left, this is just the raw audio with no sound isolation applied. So I recommend setting this somewhere in the middle or slightly above 50 or 60% for most applications. If you're not using a separate microphone, you're sort of just limiting your audio quality to what your phone can record. And right now I'm in a big untreated room. The AC is running on full blast and you can probably hear quite a bit of reverb in the room. Or maybe you're doing a shot like this where you have a mic on screen, but the mic isn't necessarily that close to your mouth. So this could be for podcasting, maybe you're walking around doing interviews, things like that. Once again, big untreated room. You can hear the AC blasting in the background, lots of reverb. Let's see how the UA sound isolation tool stacks up with an SM7B. Or maybe you're doing a shot like this where you have a mic on screen, but the mic isn't necessarily that close to your mouth. So this could be for podcasting, maybe you're walking around doing interviews, things like that. Once again, big untreated room. You can hear the AC blasting in the background, lots of reverb. So that's the AU sound isolation tool in Logic Pro. Try it out on other sound sources. Maybe you have a vocal recording that was done in a room that was not treated, or maybe you have a podcast where too many people were talking in the background. Maybe you're doing interviews out in a public space where there's a lot of background noise. The sound isolation plugin makes it super quick and easy to cut out that background noise and reverb from your voice recordings. Although I would caution to not use it on studio sung vocals if you can help it. You know, sometimes you'll get a vocal recording from a client or collaborator that's just not good. It's like a good performance, but it's a bad recording. I would typically save this for you know, like demo territory, but if you have a vocal that really needs to be saved, and even if you don't use the plugin at 100%, it's going to sound better with a little bit of the plugin than it is without, especially if you're recording in an untreated space. Since this video was so short, I saved the sponsor segment for the end, but I do want to take a moment to thank Boombox.io for sponsoring this video and sponsoring several videos across the channel over the past year and making sure that I can more consistently bring content to all of you beautiful people. Boombox is the ultimate collaboration tool for musicians, bands, producers, and studio engineers. It allows you to upload your tracks. This can be stems, multi-tracks, full bounces of mixes, or even full DAW sessions. Then what you can do is you can invite collaborators securely to add timestamped feedback on your tracks. You can even manage royalty splits with your other collaborators. Once you've finished up a project, you can create a custom playlist of your music and you can share it publicly or privately. So this is really helpful if you want to send out a playlist of an album or an EP you're working on and you want to get some private feedback before for releasing the project, this can be a really helpful tool. If you want to check out Boombox for yourself, head over to boombox.io today and sign up to get four gigabytes of free storage. 
Thanks for the support and thanks for watching.